Your whole business is built on flowers. What exactly do you guys do? So we deliver gorgeous bouquets in under an hour, starting at $35. What was so wrong with flower deliveries in the first place? Every time we sent flowers online, it just turned into a disappointing experience. They would be late, you'd get them and they might not be what you ordered, and the quality was just low, they die after a day or two. Uh, so we really, after one too many bad times, I think IJ had the worst. Yeah, so um, I was in a long distance relationship, and uh, one of her birthdays, um, I sent flowers down, was, was expecting the bouquet to surprise her, and kind of held off on calling her, um, because I was expecting to get the, oh, thank you for like the gorgeous bouquet call. Obviously I made a mistake there, not calling, uh, but the bouquet never showed up and I got in a bunch of trouble. And at that point, I called up Jeff and uh, said, hey, let's take a deeper look at this industry. Let's see why everyone has such bad experiences. So these right here, how much do these cost? This one is 35, including free delivery. Um, 45, including free delivery, and 55, uh, same thing. We've actually gone to Floris and had this recreated. Um, they've charged about $130. Each bouquet is about double if you went to a florist and just bought it off the shelf. How are you able to have premium flowers and also make it affordable? The flower gifting industry hasn't changed in close to 100 years, and there's all these middlemen in the process. So by cutting out all the middlemen and vertically integrating the entire supply chain, we go from off the farm um, to our distribution centers in New York and DC in under 48 hours. Um, and it cuts all the costs out of the system and it allows for the flowers to have the majority of their life at the end recipient's house, so the flowers last a lot longer. Whenever a bouquet arrives, we actually take a photo of it in front of the destination, in front of the building, and then we send that back to the sender so they know exactly when it arrived and that it's exactly what they ordered on the website. Whenever you send these flowers, you guys have kind of this hashtag at the bottom, this is hashtag send happy. So where'd that come from? Uh, it came from interacting with our customers and you know when we started last year around Valentine's Day and sent our first bouquets out that was the thing that kept coming up as people talked about how happy it made them so it, it very quickly became our motto of just you know send happy at a moment's notice.